Neil Young, The Needle and the Damage Done, a, a very simple acoustic guitar song, a lot of fun to play. Um, we're going to be playing this with a pick. Most of the time Neil Young plays this with a pick. He occasionally does songs like this with his fingers. But, uh, and it's just a, a matter of, it's really just a simple strumming song with very simple chords and just picking out individual notes or semi-individual notes. So all we're doing is kind of um, focusing on certain strings or combinations of strings so it doesn't just sound like this. That would be the full-on strum for every chord. All we're doing is isolating. So it's mostly involved, mostly stuff that have to do with the right hand, which is just working on focused hitting. So that's what. Right hand, obviously the one with the pick in it. Again, we're holding the pick on the side of the finger with your thumb just going across the top as lightly as possible. When you hit a note as a down with the pick, you're making sure the pick is angled up a little bit. You're not coming in straight like this. You're coming in at an angle with the pick pointing up. When you're strumming up, the pick is pointed down a little bit. So you're, you're rotating your wrist, again, in a song like this, actually all the time. And well, we're looking at a song today that is pretty slow anyway. Uh, I just clocked it. It's about 105 beats a minute. We're going gonna, gonna, gonna to go ahead and try this with a metronome. I'm going to set it at 80. and. We'll just run through it a few times. So this is really just now for you to practice getting through these chords. If you get lost, just keep your hand moving. Get the chord at the right time. It doesn't matter if you don't get the melody notes coming out exactly right or anything. This is just a folk song. Keeping the song going is the most important thing. So we'll just keep running through it. Sometimes I'll, run, I'll tell you whether I'm going to do the intro or a verse. If I'm playing the verse, I will just strum. I'm not going to worry about picking out any melody notes. So let's see what 80 sounds like. Be ready. Two, three, four. A little melody on the C chord. We're going to end on an open A right here. First. 